OPM, you know, we think of like, you know, a lot of, you know, a lot of like the legendary rock bands and everything. Yeah. And it's just where the music is going now and what's popular now. Uh, it's going to change. So mm -hmm. I don't know. For me, I would just remove the term OPM and just call it music, you know. So enjoy the music. Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, everyone has their own, you know, their own tastes. Uh, and I don't knock that at all. You know, one thing, you know, in Careless is that, you know, we don't tell artists what they have, what they have to make, you know, what's, what's sellable, like K-pop mm -hmm. is sellable right now. So you got to do like K-pop. It's, it's really like, you know, what is your sound? Let's like, you know, help you really create that. And then let's see, you know, just give people a chance to shoot their shot. Yeah. But yeah, um, you know, I've, I've learned a lot about myself, especially from the Big Brother house. This is something I say a lot. Yeah. Like he, one of the biggest things that, you know, he taught me was to dream big, which is, mm -hmm. it's so simple, but, you know, when you doubt yourself a lot, you know, you really hold yourself back from, you know, what's possible. So that was the biggest thing I took away from the house was to dream big. And yeah, I've been doing it ever since. You know, once and I realized one, it just gets bigger. And then I follow that yeah. one and it just gets bigger. So what's the next dream at the moment? Is there, is there uh, something that you're really chasing? Right now, it's, it's hard to define, but I am trying to, um, you know, with, with a music label that I'm, that I'm running with, uh, with Careless, really to help create a culture where uh, the artistry comes first, mm. you know? Um, kind of all of the, uh, I'd say, you know, the, the tools and the luxuries that I've had as an artist, I want to be able to give that to other people as well. And to really wow, bring out okay. the best in, you know, in the Philippine music industry and just, you know, uh, help create that bridge, you know, for local artists, international artists, um, yeah, just make things happen. What is the biggest thing that you've learned from having to lead other people or um, people will look to you in some sh shape or form for, for guidance mm -hmm. and for inspiration? Um, when it comes to, you know, working with a big group of people, like what I've learned, you know, I think that we do differently is that contrary to the name of the label, we really, really care. <laughs> yeah. Like... We, we just really care about the artists and the people that we work with more than, um, than like results. Mm -hmm. Like what to us is more important is, you know, the family that we have, uh, the people that we work with and yeah, just caring about what we're doing. When was that moment where you realized, um, I don't think my path is the normal love team path or, the normal Filipino artist path, but it's really different. Um, actually, I think it's more, you know, when I said to you then, like, you know, what is your identity? Like, what is it that makes you you? And even me, like, like I'm still learning as, as I'm going. And that has also evolved for me. Because um, I've learned that, you know, it, does, it matters less what it is that you're doing it matters more like, you know, who you are. Right. Like, this is who I am and I'm aspired to be this kind of person. And then everything else kind of will fall into place what you're meant to do, you know? So Did you, I think oh, that was the most important thing that I wanted to like, you know, stay, stay true to who I am and uh, like what I believe in and, you know, the vision I see for myself and everything kind of just fell into place. Like, I never knew that Kellis was really going to work. I never knew that um, you know, some of the artists I was able to work with and some of the ones I will be working with, which I can't say oh. just yet, but okay. Um, yeah, things kind of just fall into place when you're being true to who you are. Uh, one of today's hottest artists is saying at the moment with one of his newest songs, he is the man behind the careless music. He is a fellow PBB ex housemate, and he's, I guess you could say, one of the chillest guys in the whole industry. He's redefined OPM. He is James Reed, everybody on the show on Quentin Barber. What's up, James? What an intro. 
<laughs> Thank you. It's good to see you, man. Thank you for having me on the show. One mark that you want to leave on this industry, other than uh, I'm not talking about careless. I'm talking about James Reed as a person. What what is it that you want to leave on this industry? Um, that I was just true true to myself. Um, you know, I carved my own my own path. And no matter how difficult it was or, you know, all the bashing or the naysayers, you know, I still, I still carve my own path and hopefully it's a path that other artists and, you know, other musicians will be able to go down Mm -hmm. um, because it's sustainable, you know, really what we're focusing at, you know, in in careless by, uh, you know, being a music label, also managing managing artists, is that uh, you know we give the power back to them, back to the artists, yeah. back to the musicians. Um, at the same time, you know, making it a sustainable career. But to everyone watching, can you promote Hello and all the music that you're creating at the moment? Yeah. Uh, first of all, thank you, thank you, everyone. You know, for sending sending the gifts um, on Kumu. Um, thanks everyone for tuning in and of course for supporting, you know, the single hello, we do have a music video coming out. Uh, when is it? I think it's like in a week from now. So very soon. And I promise you, this will be like nothing you've seen me ever do before. I'm actually like almost, I'm terrified for this to come out, which is why I know it's good. Okay. Cause there's fear. I'm scared of this. Yes. There's fear behind this because... You know, I've never really shown people this side of me. Um, you know, I've been doing a lot of like a lot of serious stuff, but that's not always who I am. So you're going to see a very different, crazy, absolutely nuts uh, side of me in this music video for Hello. Um, it's coming out, I think, in about a week. Um, one second. And, and where will we be able to find this, the music video? All your uh, be on the Careless, yeah, Careless YouTube channel. Um, okay. Yeah, you can follow us on YouTube, uh, Careless Music, or is it Careless PH? Yeah, Careless PH. Um, there's updates, of course, on the Instagram page, uh, Careless Music. And, of course, you can follow me, at James, um, for updates as well. But yeah, that's coming right. soon, as well as some live performances and a lot of other surprises with uh, some pretty cool features. But just before James came on the show, he was actually uh, shooting something as well. And I'm sure everyone has to look out for that surprise as well. But uh, James Reed on Mix is sending on Twitter as well. A lot of people are sending their love. So real quick, last up, what do you want to say to all the people who have been supporting you for you? Not for who they want you to be, but for you. Um, I love you guys. And, you know, I, I appreciate all the support, you know, especially the ones that stick by me, even though I don't always make the decisions that they want me to make mm-hmm. um, and they, they, they stand by my choices um, both as you know a celebrity but also as a person so you know thank you everyone for the support I love you guys and uh, everyone that's on Twitter if you want that movie with me and Edward to happen you need to tweet about it and make a trend <laughs> I think it ain't uh, gonna happen uh, I don't think it's gonna happen but uh, hey man we can dream we can dream dreams are always good hey Thank you, James, for coming on the show. I really, really appreciate Thank it. Thank you, man. Uh, God bless, bro. And I hope that in any capacity, we get to work together very soon. All right. Absolutely. Looking forward All to right. it. All ha- right. Have a good one, bro. Take care, man. You too.